in today's video, I actually try to build a dragon in Minecraft Hardcore Survival. And let's just say it turns out pretty sick. Hey guys, it's Retro here and welcome to Hardcore Minecraft, where if we die, this series ends. We've officially made it to episode 10. So I want to say thank you for all the support that you guys have been giving me. It, you know, it really does mean a lot to me. And I really do appreciate it. But with that being said, let's get on with the video. Okay, so basically, in the last video, I built a new enchanting room for our base. Now, I've decided to kind of refine it a bit more. Give it a bit more oomph, you know what I mean? I also built ourselves a new farmhouse because I know we're going to get a lot more farm supplies and I know we're going to need the more storage. We're also going to need to work on the interior of the farmhouse as well. I was feeling like our enchanting table was bland. So, I decided to add a circle inside the circle that we already had, which is around the enchanting table. Huh? I don't know. But here it is. As you can see, I'm actually using the purple concrete powder to get purple concrete. And I'm gonna use it for the enchanting area to kind of make the fog effect better and also make it look cleaner because so far inside of the glass, you can actually see like the cobble and everything below it. And I don't really like how you can see that. And so instead I'm gonna use the purple concrete to fill in the walls and hopefully that will make it look better. And boom, here's our actual enchanting area. So I'm, I'm actually liking it. I actually really, really like our little, uh, little circle kind of design. I mean, I really just thought it would make it look a bit more, how to say, uh, less, less bland, obviously, and kind of give it like the nether's kind of leaking out of it. You know what I mean? It's kind of like leaking out of the enchanting area and it's just like into the ground. And I kind of really like that. I kind of like concept. Oh my God, it is bright out here. God damn. Let me just turn off the shaders. Oh, so much better. Okay. So we're actually going to go over here now. Off screen, I did build uh, one of the villager houses. So let me just show you guys that real quick. And welcome to the first villager house out of the, how many do we have? Four, I think. Yeah, four. Yeah, we have four. This is the first version. I, I mean, I, I really like this one. It's kind of small. It's, it's, you know, it's tiny. It, it looks good. I mean, I really like it. And it, if you go inside, I mean, we don't have really anything in here. I think I might put a bed and like maybe a crafting table, lectern or something. We can actually probably do that right now. Let's do that. So it turns out we don't actually have any spare wool. So I'm actually going to come over here and we're going to go on a little carpet here. And we're just, oh my God, we're just going to take all of their wool. Sorry, guys. Hey. Hey, hey, hey. Now we have 29 wool. We're going to make ourselves just we'll make, we'll make a bed. You know what? We have a crafting table right here. So we can do it here. We don't have, oh, we do have wood. Let's do that. Take that. And we're going to just bang and make, we can make, we'll just make one. Or should we make it color? We're going to make purple because I've got purple dye on us. Make three. There we go. Cool. And then, so we're just going to make a purple bed for that little village house. All right. Sick. Hello, Steve. How you doing? Hey, Steve. Love Steve. Steve's sick. All right. There we go. Oh my goodness. There we go. There's the first bed. So now we can just probably put a crafting table here. We can actually do that right now. Just have a little crafting table there. There we go. And so that's basically it really. That's all we really need in there. So some of you guys might be actually wondering what this square is. Now, I mean, I don't want to really give it away, but it is going to be something pretty cool. We're going to be for episode 10, we're going to be building a dragon and I am excited. I don't know if I'm going to really make a Japanese style because a Japanese dragon doesn't have wings. And I've like kind of looked into like reference images and, and like, etc. And really, we can't really like, I mean, I want to give it wings and I, I know it's Japanese themed and I, like, you know, most Japanese dragons are like snakes. I think I'm just going to not do the Japanese dragon and just give it wings because why not? Like, I think that would look cooler anyways. And so I'm just going to do that plan for the day. We're going to have to collect some material. So the materials I want to collect is blackstone, a lot of blackstone, maybe some nether bricks. I'm not sure. We might have to go. We're going to have to go to the nether, but we're going to have to collect some concrete and a lot of white concrete as well. So we're going to have to mostly collect a lot of gravel and sand. So let's get on with it. Okay. So I'm just going to collect this sand right here because we do need it to make the concrete, uh, concrete powder and then concrete. Do 
you guys think I have enough sand? <laughs> okay, well, let's just block this part up. Oh shit, it's night time. Let's go, 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 let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Nigel, Jane, hey, your spider, spider man, spider. -Man. I swear, I always have to kill a spider over here. You, you got nothing on me. I think I'm just gonna keep blocking this hole up, and then I'm gonna start going and collecting or making uh, materials. Now, in between videos, I did get actually raided. My base got raided, so I got an ominous banner and I had bad omen for a while, but while I was building the enchanting area, it actually went away. Okay, so I've got some chests. I'm going to put some chests here because we're going to use these for our little farming supplies and I'm going to have to move around our chests in our actual base, but I'm going to put two here as well. Okay, so instead of having the farm just like in this little area over here, I'm going to have it extend over here because I think it looks better and it'll, it will look better, but I was doing it and my hoe just broke. Before we do that, I'm going to go into the farm area we have a little beetroot growing and we have a little melons oh look how cute they are Hi. melon but we'll get those later just i'm gonna go i'm gonna take this rose away and i'm gonna kind of put like some pumpkins down here because this is our farmhouse so i think pumpkins would look kind of nice down here um i think i'm gonna put a bookshelf there and then maybe just like kind of have you can hear a skeleton maybe there's a skeleton downstairs go go and see oh no that's that's just that's just the campfire never mind anyways <laughs> uh, i'm gonna put the pumpkin here and i'm just gonna have it like maybe i think maybe this side will look a bit better uh maybe like that and so, yeah, there we go. That's all right. And I, maybe if we collect some more wheat, I think we could put some hay bales as well on this side. And then after that, we can just, you know, we could actually have the rose maybe just there. Oh, no, I don't think it really suits here. So I'm just going to leave it out. But yeah, okay. So let's go inside and it's going to spice up this area because I think it'd look better with a lot of some more bookshelves because why not? Who doesn't love a good bookshelf? You know what I'm saying? Uh, we're also going to go downstairs and put some bookshelves down here as well. So there, now we have some books. That's all right. It's actually... No, I don't think I'll put bookshelves there. I think I might put slabs there. Do I have any? I do have a crafting table. Is there a crafting table down here? Yep. And we're going to actually just do like that. And then maybe like that. There we go. That's all right. And it'll kind of look like a, it'll, it'll kind of look like it's a stove. <laughs> I don't know. I don't really know what I'm going with here, but it's all right. I, I, I like it like that. Oh my God. Oh my God. Okay. Um. Yeah, I think that's all right for now. I'm not sure what else to do. I don't know what else we could do really. Not really much else. We could actually put some... We'll put the bookshelves back here, maybe. Here, let's see. Put the Maybe you put the crafting table in the middle. And put it right here. And then... And kind of just fill it up like this. And then we'll put our lantern there. And we could probably put another lantern in the middle like that. Oh, we don't really need it there anyways. Because it's like a campfire. So, you know, we'll just get rid of it. And we'll just hold on to that. Obviously, we have the chest on top of each other. Like down here and up here, obviously. So, these two chests... This one's probably going to be for... The seeds and wheat, so we can just have all of our seeds and wheat in here, and probably just like all our farm supplies over there. And this one's gonna be probably for sugarcane because our we have a full sugarcane chest in our house, and it's kind of getting really full. So I feel like we should move it over into the farmhouse and maybe just have like other chests in here as well. I think we might put barrels in here. I think we should make some barrels. We're gonna grab our wheat in here, which is not that much, and we're gonna go over. You know what? We, we'll empty out our chest first. So let's let's empty out our stuff into the nether chest. And then we could probably just take all the seeds, maybe. Yep, there we go. That's good. I like that. I like that. Castle, the castle. We do need to actually expand this little farm, though, because we need to make it a bit better. Because I, it's kind of annoying me. Oh, no. Oh, oh, frick, dude. All right, you know what? Let's go inside and pull them in this way. No, 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 you know what? Guys, bro. Die, bro. All right. Goodness gracious. God damn. You know what? We're going to go into our farmhouse and put away our wheat. There we go. There we go. Look at that beautiful bad boy. There we go. I like that. I like that. We're going to have to get some concrete. So the colors I'm going to do is black, light gray, or gray, and white. So we're going to have to get some white dye, some black dye, and some gray dye. But I think we have some in here. But for now, we're just going to make... Oh, I need gravel. Do I have any gravel? Let's see. Please, 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 please. Gravel, 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 gravel. I might have used all the gravel for our enchanting room. Damn, no way. Damn it. That's okay. All right, I'm just going to go collect some gravel. I 
come back later and grab as much gravel as we need as, as we go. Because I can't really, I don't really know how much gravel I do need. All I know is that a lot, you know what I mean? We're going to need a lot. But anyway, but with that being said, I have already most of the concrete that we're going to need for now. I also have heaps of stone bricks in there. And I most I already mostly have all the materials we're going to need for the start of the build. This is probably one of the biggest projects I've done so far uh in this in this in this in this world and so if you guys are excited leave a like down below and if and if you want to keep seeing more of my pointless building in this world subscribe okay so i think i'm going to go to the nether now because we're gonna need to get some blackstone and we already got some for and i think it's time because we need to get a bit more maybe like a almost a stack so let's go and get that real quick okay and we have made it so i'm gonna go to our blackstone mine and it's up here somewhere so let's go go this way how for what reason I bet. Thank you. Uh, uh, this whole sand. This whole sand. There it is. There's that little base. There it is. Go away. Go away. Go away. There we go. Okay. So we're going to go up here. Made a little little staircase for us. And we go in here. This way. Oh, we go this way. So I know you guys haven't seen this before, but I made this little area just so I could get some blackstone because I was mining to get some netherrack and I found some basalt and blackstone everywhere. So let's just, let's just, let's just get started. Let's go and collect our blackstone that we need. <laughs> anyways we have more space so if we go up i think here is actually most of the blackstone yeah so basically there's like i don't know for some reason there's like blackstone pools or like for like veins here and i don't know i've never like really come across something like that i thought i thought it was actually a bastion area i think it is a bastion area but i haven't found the actual area but anyway let's just collect a bit more and i think that should be it yeah i think i think we're good i think that will last us a bit but that's all right and we have a lot of arrows because there's a lot of skeletons out here but with that being said, let's go back home and start dragon building. Or maybe, you know, some people might call it point. Wow. Building. And we should start our build. Now, I'm pretty excited about the dragon build because we have pretty much all the materials we need. Now, all I need to do is actually do the concrete. So we can do that right now before we even continue. So basically, what I'm going to do is actually I'm just going to like, so we're going to put all the concrete on top of each other because if we break the bottom, then it will all start falling and it will just be easier to mine. So I think we should be able to just do this real quick. And we shouldn't take damage from up here anyways, because we're going to fall into water anyway. So let's see how much more we need. There we go. And you know what? We'll put some white up here as well. Okay. And we're going to drop down into the water. Beautiful. So like, look at that. And then we're going to make another pile just for the white. There we go. Okay. And we're just going to build this up as well. I am actually incredibly excited for this build. I hope you guys are excited too. I think it might take me a couple hours to do. So if you guys... Are excited leave a like down below and if you guys enjoy the build when it happens don't forget to subscribe because i'll probably be doing more projects like that as well so stay tuned but there we go now we have all the concrete let's just go grab all the concrete that we missed grabbing and with that being said let us start on this bad boy oh my god look at it And there we go, we're done. So now we have all of our concrete and we are actually pretty much set. I think I'm, if I have to collect more in between takes, I'll just go collect it because honestly, it, this we need we need more gravel and then we should be sweet and what we need is dye, but that's easy to get anyways. Uh, for the black concrete, obviously I had to go get some squids, which were delicious over there. And you know, it didn't take me that long. Okay, and it's time to get into the dragon build. I'm pretty excited right now. I This is like my biggest project yet, obviously. And I've been you know collecting for a while now. So hopefully this turns out good. And I think it will will so without further ado let's get into some pointless building <laughs> nah but let's get into the dragon build
This dragon actually looks insane. I'm actually so happy with how it came out. I know the wing looks a bit f right now, but I'll fix it in the next episode. If you guys did enjoy the dragon build though, leave a like down below and let me know in the comments as well, because I want to know what you guys think. If you guys also want to see all my last videos of this series, there's a link in the description of the playlist. Check it out. But with that being said, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.